So James Ryan, uh, the new player of uh, Slunet Austi uh, Nadlabem. So James, uh, was this uh, first half of today's game uh, something that you could be capable of delivering uh, or yeah, let's say del delivering uh, every single night? Uh, absolutely. Uh, I'm a scorer. Uh, I've been a scorer my whole life. Uh, and I do whatever whatever the team needs me to do. Uh, if it needs me to score, I'll score, play defense, uh, whatever it is. And in this game, uh, I just happen to be scoring. So that's what I did. And uh, yeah, it's definitely what I'm capable of doing. Uh, like, was, uh, was the motivation of your team like uh, reaching sky heights today? Uh, absolutely. Uh, anytime you're going against uh, the top team in any league, uh, you're going to bring it your all. And uh, we brought it today in the first half. Unfortunately, we couldn't uh, keep it going, but uh, we fought hard, and I'm proud of, proud of the way we played. Uh, was it sort of uh, advantage that, that uh, your opponent probably couldn't uh, scout you as well as, uh, as, as probably in the middle of the season because your new team, your new player in Europe is... Uh, sure, yeah. Uh, we couldn't scout them as well, so I feel like it goes, uh, goes both ways. Uh, both, both teams are playing hard. We both had uh, some good players on each team and uh, we were going at it uh, hard. Uh, after facing uh, just lower division German teams in the preparation or in the scrimmage games, uh, so uh, how tough was it to play the team that's uh, trying to reach the Euroleague? Uh, they're definitely uh, on another level than those ger lower division German teams that we did play. Uh, we did play a uh, BBL team as well. Uh, we played them tough. Uh, but yeah, this is a very good team here in Nimburg. Was it big jump like after these after playing the German teams? Uh, absolutely, um, definitely every guy like you like you saw out there uh, this is six seven six eight, um, and yeah, they're they're definitely a, a much better team. Uh, actually, you you play just uh, six players uh, against the uh, defending champion. So when did you start to feel? Uh, uh, when did you start to feel it? Was it like somewhere in the at the end of the third uh, quarter? Uh, yeah, uh, we definitely. Uh, Definitely got a little fatigue there, but uh, the adrenaline was was kicked in pretty much the whole game. I don't know about my teammates, but for myself, I didn't get too tired out there. So uh, we're definitely uh, conditioning well in practice, and coach is doing a good job of uh, keeping us in good shape. So I think we're ready for the season, and a lot of these guys can play the whole game. So uh, we weren't too tired. You can with just nine players. So how many were you missing actually today? Um, we have a we have a big man that. Uh, wasn't able to be activated tonight, but um, he'll be he'll be available for us the rest of the season. Uh, maybe a couple more guys too, so 11, 12 guys. So is it Mitchell or Patton? Mitchell correct? Patton, correct. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Uh, so you had just two points in the third. I mean, you, you yourself. Uh, so so did Nimburg to start to to help you, help on you? Absolutely. In the third? Uh, they were a face lot? guarding me a lot. Uh, they were definitely uh, putting a lot more pressure on me. They didn't want me to uh, go off for another however many points it was in the first half. But uh, yeah, got to give credit to their defense. Uh, they really guarded well in that second half. So after probably everybody or whole league saw it today on TV, so, so you, you probably can, can, uh, can expect that in any other game. Yeah, I'm just going to have to uh, work harder in practice, uh, get in the weight room a little bit, uh, and just keep, keep working hard because uh, teams are going to be coming after us, not just myself, but uh, the rest of our team. I think we, uh, I think we showed well tonight. Uh, first impressions from Usti and from the country. I mean, what's your impressions? I mean, after the first days here, uh, I think we have a good team. Uh, I think we competed hard against a top top level team, uh, and I think, uh, yeah, we should. Uh, there's no letting down from from here on out. Uh, we're we're gonna keep playing hard and uh, hopefully come out uh, in the top top end of this league when it's all said and done. I just meant more. I mean, outside of outside the basketball court. So, what are your first impressions from the community? Oh, okay, uh, I like it a lot. Um, the community is very, very welcoming. Everyone's been very nice. Um, can't ask for more. Being from uh, California, uh, first time in Europe, uh, they're definitely making me feel at home out in, out in Usti. So, I'm having a having a good time playing uh, playing the game I love. Oh, actually, I did, uh, forgot it for for a while. Uh, where did you play the the last season, or I mean, you know, the the first after NCAA? Yeah, uh, I played in the uh, the D League for a little bit. Played with the Texas Legends, um, and then yeah, coach uh, coach found me in uh, Vegas this summer and came out here to Usti for my first season in Europe. So I'm uh, excited for the season. So could the first profi game in in Europe be better, sir? Uh, <laughs> could it be better? I mean, even better. Uh, after after such a good result, I mean, 
most for, for the most part of the personally? game. Personally? I mean, personally, yeah. Oh, absolutely. Uh, I'm just getting started. Uh, this is just the beginning. Um, there's a lot more I could, could improve on. Uh, turn the ball over a couple times too many here in the second half. But, uh, yeah, it's, there's just things that I'm going to sharpen up on. Uh, and, yeah, there's definitely a ton of room for improvement on uh, my end. And the toughest question, of course, uh, could you already greet the fans in Czech for any word? <laughs> Um, the Usti fans? Or the yeah, yeah of fans? course, definitely. Um, yeah, I'm just excited to play and uh, looking forward to a competitive, uh, competitive league. And I mean, uh, I'm sorry, I mean, I mean in Czech, if, if there are oh. some first words already. Uh, I only know ciao, ahoy, just a couple, couple small words, nothing, uh, nothing big. I haven't picked up too much yet, but uh, hopefully, uh, hopefully I'll get someone to teach me. So last quote, ciao fans. Ciao fans. Thanks.